I have a train that was bought by Johnny Cash. All right. Um, Lionel 260E, first owner Johnny Cash, December 1932. So Johnny Cash was the first owner of this? Yes. Cool. One thing I always say about Johnny Cash, if you take a list of the top 10 coolest guys ever, he's on the list twice. <laughs> I love trains because my dad uh, basically got me started. And when he passed away, I uh, ended up opening up his trains, and I've been into it ever since. I want to sell this train because I have some grandchildren coming up, and uh, I want to be able to give them things that I didn't have as a kid. I mean, it's pretty cool, dude. This is a 1932 Lionel? Yes. 1932, I mean, that was the big deal, was trains. There was no jet planes or anything like that. Think about it, before the train, it was six months to get across the United States. They made it four days. Hmm. It just became part of Americana. So you're saying Johnny Cash bought this when he was a little kid? Tommy Cash took this to a repair shop in Hagerstown, Maryland to have totally restored. Okay, so this was Tommy Cash's? No, this his, was Johnny Johnny's. Cash's brother's? This was Johnny's, but Tommy Cash wanted to have it re totally refurbished for him. And unfortunately, he never went back and picked it up and ended up selling it to the shop where it was repaired. All right, so do we have a whole chain of custody or anything? The gentleman who bought it from the repair shop, he was given this letter to explain the chain of command. Okay, it's definitely an interesting story. I'm assuming you want to sell it? Yeah. And how much do you want for it? 15000 Ooh. Sounds a little high. I'm saying 1500 bucks. How about 8000 it, It's not there. It, it's not. You know, I mean, if this was one of Johnny Cash's guitar, to be doing backflips off But it off did, but it was bit. owned by Johnny Cash. Okay. He also owned Q-tips. You know, it doesn't have the right association with the celebrity to make it worth a lot of money. We're talking John Wayne's hat, mm -hmm. okay? Um, Charlie Chaplin's cane. I will give you $2,000 for it. That's what I can do. I can't go a dime more. Okay. Sold. I'll meet you right over there, and uh, we'll write this thing up. This is going on my mantle. <laughs> I'm going to take this $2,000 and buy my kids a train. <laughs> <laughs>